Here, the question is: A company is going to provide their employees with a bonus, which will be based on the employee's length of service in the company. The bonus calculation will be zero if they have been with the company for less than two years. Ten percent of their salary for more than two, but less than five years, and twenty-five percent for five to ten years, thirty-five percent for ten years or more. The interface will not allow a negative value to be input, but it will allow a zero to be input. How many equivalent partitions are needed to test the calculation of the bonus? And these are our options. Here we just have to find out how many equivalent partitions are required. Let's draw the equivalent partitions diagram to find the answer. As per the question, the first condition is the bonus calculation will be zero. If they have been with the company for less than two years, that means two year is one of the boundaries. Let's analyze the second condition. Ten percent of their salary for more than two, but less than five years. That means five year is the second boundary. The third condition is twenty five percent for five to ten years. That means ten is the next boundary, and the fourth condition is thirty-five percent for ten years or more. Fifth condition is the interface will not allow a negative value to be input. That means zero is one of the boundaries too. Now the question is. How many equivalent partitions are needed to test the calculation of the bonus? From the diagram, it's clear that we need five equivalent partitions. Therefore, option D is the answer.